This video introduces the shooting interface basics. After connecting, tap Live to enter the shooting interface. Here is the mode selection. On the right is the common functions. On the left is the auxiliary functions. In the center is the preview with the joystick. At the bottom is the information display. Click here to choose the mode, such as general mode. Click here to switch the way of shooting. For example, when doing time lapse, tap here to set the interval and duration. After enabling PIP, tap the PIP window or the T and W buttons on the right to switch the main view. In Telephoto Main View, open the focus panel for auto or manual focus. Or double tap the screen to focus. Zoom with two fingers, then pan with one to inspect details. Tap parameters to adjust settings for telephoto or wide angle. Tap outside the panel to close it. To move your dwarf, drag the joystick's central ball. The farther you drag, the faster it moves. Tap the arrows to move slightly to fine tune. Press and hold the arrows to move quickly in one direction. Set the main view to wide angle, double tap any area, and the telephoto will automatically focus on that spot. Tap here to return to home screen without stopping shooting. Tap here to show or hide PIP. Tap here to view the album. Tap here or long press on a blank area to hide UI. Long press again to restore it. These are the unique features for each shooting mode. For example, Deep Sky Mode offers EQ alignment, dark frames, etc. While General Mode includes standard object tracking, tap the button and start shooting.